I ask the persons here present to witness that I, Corey Glenn Young, take you, Cara Ann Fattore, to be my lawful wedded wife. <laughs> yeah. I promise I'll try my best to give you the life I deserve. Well, you deserve. <laughs> very special occasion for Cara and for Corey, their wedding day here at this beautiful venue. It's going to be a celebration of love and of commitment and of all of you, their friends and their family, and two people who are most certainly in this forever. never thought this day would arrive. It's been such a long time <coughs> in coming. A very long time. Thank you, Cara. Corey, you finally made the right decision. I want you to know that we love you very much and uh, wish you the very best for the future. And may it be as wonderful as you guys are. you these things. I will laugh with you in times of joy and comfort you in times of sorrow. I will share in your dreams and support you as you strive to achieve your goals. I will listen to you with compassion and understanding and speak to you with encouragement. You are my best friend, my soulmate, and I will love you and respect you for as long as we both shall live. My wife and I yeah. would like to start by saying thank you to everyone for coming. Obviously you're here, you mean a lot to us, like we love you all and it's just a pleasure, absolute pleasure. Cheer loudly for these two, show your excitement as I declare Corey and Cara. Um, Cara, I'm so thankful that Corey has you in his life. I'm ha thankful that you're in our lives. Um, you, you two are, honestly, people look at you and you are so in love, even yesterday, just getting all smushy. Um, you can see it and it's real. We love it. Thank you both very much and thank you, certainly on behalf of the, bri the bridal party, but also myself. Everyone have a great night, dance, have fun. So, uh, remember today, this beautiful location. Remember the faces, the voices, the music, the laughter. Remember the excitement, the preparation, the trepidation and the expectation. Remember your vows, your promises, your commitments. Most of all, remember each other and the love that you share. Now I'm going to get to the serious stuff. I want grandchildren. I would like you all to congratulate our fabulous bride and groom as it is my very great pleasure to formally present to you all for the very first time, Mr. and Mrs. Corey and Cara Young. I'm 
staying faithful to our vows for better, for worse, and in sickness and in health. You are my best friend, my soulmate, and I'll love and respect you as, as long as we both shall live. <laughs>